all right so what is going on today youtube here we go going in with a deck request from somebody uh not from but somebody but i believe it's a uh, random ix um yeah he requested this deck it is called kaiju magic it's with magicians and kaijus and as you see we open up both and we open up a demock which is amazing all right so what does this do if you control okay this card okay you can special in addition all right so that's a quick play we can go ahead and do that but hold on real quick i have to go attend to something and already i am back so what we're going to do is start off with okay what do you do once we turn this card is targeted okay and then this if this is destroyed wait you can target a dart and it gains 12 you can make it four thousand fucking attack that is amazing so we're going to go ahead and so what does this even do um if this card cannot be used cannot be okay so we're going to special summon this right and then uh, hopefully this doesn't get to all right so there we go bam we get a banish one card i believe this does not target um okay it doesn't target so that should be pretty good <clears throat> go ahead and go ahead and banish that and then we can make this four thousand and then what does it say if this card you can special my lower from your hand then change it to that if this card is destroyed you can target up to three other magician girls with different names add that to your hand all right so you know we're going to just go in with 28 because i feel you know that's pretty good <clears throat> so we're already starting off pretty good um this doesn't come back or anything does it uh, i might as well attempt to activate it it's in the end phase shouldn't we this should work break this no oh, no no see then it goes to um pretty much whoever turned basically priority pretty much what is it on something you could special in a royal channel from your graveyard or hand a defense position why wow, you have another one you just opened up triple that's just retarded all right so it looks like let me see I probably should have equipped it this. I should have equipped it this. I mean, not equipped it. I should have activated it because then, um, yeah, I could have made it 12,000. All right, Duelist Alliance. That is pretty good. We're going to activate. Um, and then I guess we activate that. Now, I've not played with any Pendulum cards. Okay. Um, hmm. I, I, I. See, I, I said I've not played with. What is going on? Why would you quit, sir? Oh, we was doing so good. Alrighty, then here we go with the second duel of the day. Hopefully, our opponent does not quit, and we have won the rock paper scissors. And like always in the beginning of the video, I like to say if you guys do enjoy this video, leave a like, leave a comment, and also subscribe if you have not already. And if you guys can click and add to support the channel. So, what do you do if this card is almost so You can add a magician girl to your hand. What do you do? While you control a spell, any damage you take. If this card is sent from the fields of the river, you target it. Okay. So, what we're going to do, we're going to thin the deck out. All right. We're going to just go ahead and do this. And then once we turn, we're going to activate a card to fit the target's this card. Special summon of addition. Oh, now that's a good ass effect. That is a good ass effect. So, is there any play you can discard this card? Magician girls. Okay. All right. That does something in the hand. Um, you know what? I think I want to continue to keep this going. So we're going to just go ahead and start using Stratos because this is a, a very good effect. And we're going to use the young trade in real quick. Ooh, we've done to a taco magician girl at this. So we're going to set both. Um, so yeah, I, I mean, we're, we're starting off. It's a decent start off. Now, this kind of is kind of bad right now because we don't have any pendulums. But this can very this can definitely come in handy when some pendulums and since this is all right so we're going up against Buster Blader all right um, so anything we take is damage I mean it's halved then if this is sent to the graveyard I can you know special summon something back what does that one do okay bench this card infusion summon all right so I'm pretty sure he's not going to be attacking so then we can you know we can keep up the what's the names we can keep up the uh, yeah, I was about to say, if he attacks, that would be kind of stupid. All right, we do double. That's kind of not the greatest card. Oh, we could normal summon this and send this. But I don't think that would be good. We're going to use this again. We're going to use some more baby magicians. And now, what we're going to get here is the one that, if I discard it, you know, we can get some shit popping. What is this? This one? No, it is this one, right? Discard this card. All right, and then what does it say? 
Um, and until the end of the turn, cannot be destroyed by card effects, and your opponent cannot target them with card effects. Okay, so we're going to use this. Because I feel like this is a good card. And it should boost these both to 700. Oh, to 1,000. What? With different... Wait, what? For... For Magician Girls... Oh. For each Magician Girl with different names on the field and in the... Oh, okay. That's a fucking amazing card. I've never played Magician Girls in my life. Never even read them. So... If I fuck up this, uh, okay, well, that's happening. We knew that was happening. Um, that's cool. That That's fine with me. Like I said, we have a dog around, so we can definitely just get over everything right now. This does not, none of this really matters. He's going to special summon a Buster Blader. And then this is sending these two on the field. Um, no, you just special summon a free fucking Buster Blader. Yes, I'm going to continue my battle. I'm going to attack this. And he should activate the one in the graveyard, giving him the, uh, okay. Um, what, what's that do? You just equipped, right? Okay. So you're just equipped in, as far as I know, right? Um, once we turn, the opponent's turn, you can target yeah, and equipped it. And so this one's going to shoot some one bus by banishing fit this drawing from your graveyard. All right. So you only have two. So you activate this for what specific reason? Hmm, folks, doesn't this die at the end phase? What if something makes it die at the end phase? Oh, end phase of the next turn. Okay, so these two go into defense mode. Well, that's fine with me. We're going to go ahead and do this. Um, I guess over you, because this is the problem. But this would die next turn. Um, I don't want to get pierced. Yeah, actually, if if I do this, he can't get anything back. I have to get rid of something. Uh, let's get rid of that. Um, as far as I know, I mean, what does this do? Okay. So now what I can do is I could literally just, I can wait, to be honest with you. And I think that's what I'm going to do here because I feel like um, <clears throat> if I even like get rid of these off the board, we're going to be in a whole shitload of trouble because this shit special summons. So... That should be good. This is going to die during the end of his turn. So unless he plays something, you know, spectacular, then, you know, we're going to be decent. We're going to be real good. Um, yeah, man, I, I, I don't know why I'm playing against Buster Bladers now, but it seems like every time I play a certain deck, a Buster Blader comes out. But yeah, uh, another thing I did want to go ahead and, uh, okay, start his dragon. I don't understand why you go into that. Okay, well, you can get a free Buster, right? Yeah, once we turn, if you do not control a Buster Blade, you can just get one back, and then he can just discard a card and add back the this, right? Or oh, you already have another one, so it really didn't matter. All right, so this this is gonna hurt. This is going to hurt because um no, it's not going to hurt, is it? Actually, he can just add this back, right? Yeah, I, I think we're going to, I probably should have got rid of it. I, I, either way, either way it went, I was getting hit by a, a fucking, wow, no, you messed up. Why would he not do, what the hell is going on? Okay, yeah, so I was about to say, shouldn't this, this triggers. And we're going to get a Chaco Magician Girl. Um, Right? Once we turn, you can discard one. Okay, if this card is targeted. You could special summon, right? Yeah, I, I don't understand what. Why is everybody quitting? Like you're losing, you quit against Dark Magician girls. So all right, here we go against the Lazy Fox, and we're gonna go back on the USA servers. And it looks like the US, the USA servers are actually working pretty good. Now we can't activate that, but we can activate this, and this is what we can do. We can activate this Young Duelist Alliance, or the du yeah, it's Duelist Alliance, not Duelist Advent. I was about to call it Duelist Advent, but. Um, a thing that I am thinking about doing is, uh, <clears throat> is, um, I'm, I'm thinking about do, like doing like a, like, uh, on Monday, like today, you know how people, you know, request decks and stuff like that. I'm thinking when people don't request decks, because now I'm going to just be doing probably one to two duels or just like one video of the decks because of, uh, what's the name? Because of like a lot of people request decks. So I'm just going to start, oh, no, we're playing against Cosmos. This is going to hurt. 
Um, but I'm going to do probably do like one video. Like this is probably be the only magician video unless, you know, you guys requested some more. Or if you guys want to see the deck again. So we're going to just do one video on Monday, pretty much uh, what you guys want to see and stuff like that. And then like for the Mondays that nobody does suggest some or of that Sunday between, you know, the time period and stuff like that. If nobody does request anything, then what I'm going to do is probably do like uh, I'm going to do a list of decks I always wanted to play and then, you know, have you guys vote on it or something like that and possibly do like a live stream and just build the deck there. I, I want to see how that actually works. You know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> it sounds like a good idea. You guys let me know if you guys want me to do like a, a live stream of just, just building random certain decks. Um, so <clears throat> as you can see, well, I, I didn't really explain that right. So pretty much what I'm thinking about doing is, uh, you know what I have down here. I don't understand the point of doing that when you know I have a pendulum switch. Yes, I'm going to just special summon this card in defense mode, right? It's 2100 defense. Yeah, well, I, I'm not understanding. Why would I not do that? Maxi, sure, sir. I don't, once again, I don't understand why you did that. That was stupid. You knew what I had. You knew I searched this out with the Duelist Alliance. Um, but basically what I want to start doing is on Monday, if it's not a, 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 a deck that is being re that got requested, then I'm going to like try to do a live stream and just build a deck and play it for like probably an hour, hour and a half. I don't know. Um, I should have time. What the fuck is this man doing? <laughs> I don't know. What is he doing? Like, I, I, I don't get like you literally could have added this back, then activated the effect to draw and then go stoker. Like if that was your whole plan. You could have easily done that. So that that once that was stupid in itself. I don't understand that. But <clears throat> like I guess his name is Lazy Fox for a reason. Because that was one of the worst plays I've seen in my lifetime. So we're definitely going to activate this during the end phase. We don't want another mi uh, uh, another mistake where uh, we activate it on our turn and it says you cannot activate your battle phase this turn. So this man is going to go ahead and get oop to ooh why you didn't. All right, so there we go. Uh, hmm. So I can just do this to put that right back in the scales. Activate the Duelist Alliance. You can only use one. Okay, so we're going to get this Pendulum. What's the name? Uh, we're going to set this. Hmm. Hmm. How do I want to do this? See, if I normally... Wait, what? What does it say? Once we turn for activate effect that targets this card, I can change it. Hmm. See, I can normal summon it, but he's going to probably kill it. So, I mean, he's probably going to negate it, which, you know, I'm not going to blame him. And I think I'm going to use this pendulum switch when he attacks just so I can. Uh, let's use this pendulum switch. Right in defense mode. If he attacks over it, I'm just going to try to pop it. That's fine. He's going to pay a thousand. We're going to get some shit going off. We're going to get something going off. We're going to get some life points paid. But yeah, so let me know what you guys think about that. Like a live stream every Monday or something like that. Or a live stream, you know, once a month or something where I just build a deck and play it. Like uh, I always wanted to play like like a ritual demise deck or something like that. Or like an insect deck or just something. Yeah. Wow. I forgot. I forgot this shit does that. I forgot that the new magicians they made trigger at any point in time that they uh they are killed. All right, there's another magician girl for some odd reason. I hope I get twin twisted here. That would be amazing. And we do have have a stardust in here. <laughs> I know last time we did not have a stardust. Um, you know what? Yeah, let's sure. Let's just go ahead and get some max damage on board. Let's go ahead and bring you back out. So he can't even negate this. Like he can't even strike it. Um, all right, since I already have another one in the hand, we're going to go ahead and get Chaco Magician Girl. I feel like that's a pretty good card. Um, like I said, I, I've not played, I don't, I never played Magician Girl, never even thought of playing Magician Girl. I, I, only person I've ever seen really play Magician Girls is you build mastery, and that was some of the most boring duels I've seen in a lot in a minute. And I, and he, he's a cool dude, man. He has a cool channel, to say it like that. Um, I don't know him personally, but his channel, I, I love this channel. You know, he was putting up duels every day. I think that pretty much got him. Uh, that's what pretty much put him in the sabbatical that he is in now. He's not really uploading Yu-Gi-Oh! videos a lot like that anymore. But he was uploading every single day a different duel video. 
And yes, it does get tiring. If you guys, you know, if you guys are wondering that, it gets very, you know, frustrating and tiring that you got to, you know, duel every single day. So I can understand his burnout from Yu-Gi-Oh. But back to the duel. Uh, not really too much to say. We're we're just massively up on damage. So hopefully we just get twin twisted here. Um, the Senate Pendulum Switch. I keep calling it Senate Switch because <laughs> I was thinking about that card the last couple of days. But this Pendulum Switch is doing work. We're easily okay. Well, this is fine with me, sir. You're gonna just attack into this Berry Magician girl. We're gonna do some very good things. You, you you get it. You get the joke. I think he might have another ghost orc in his hand. I'm, I'm thinking it's a ghost orc in his hand right now. I believe it is. I believe it's a ghost orc in his hand, if I'm not mistaken. It has to be something that can, you know, be activated. Um, it may be a, it may be, what's the name? It may be Winner's Ghost Ash. No, it isn't. It isn't. All right, so he's going to just allow this card. Once we turn this card to target it, okay, that doesn't do anything. Okay, none of these does anything on the summon, right? Okay, no. This is Chocolate Magician Girl. Does he play Bahama Chart? Uh, no, we don't. We don't play Bahama Chart. Okay. Because I was like, you know what? Wait. What's going on here? What the f... Bro, I didn't know... Wait, what? Oh, okay. That's where I fucked up. I, I, I'm, I'm dumb for that one. That was my mistake. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, that causes a re that causes a re a replay, but I don't have anything in my graveyard, so this doesn't activate. So yeah, that is uh, that was a problem just now. But you know what? We're good. We are okay. Um, I don't know. We can't really advance our game state. That's fine. Please don't be a Western. I think it's going to be a, a slip rider or something. I'm just going to believe it's going to be a slip rider. Uh, yeah, I knew it. I knew it was going to be a slip rider or something. He's probably going to, no, he's going to pop that. Okay, well, this is activating, sir. I'm going to get you out for the last time. Oh. How are we going to get you out for the last time? Man, this, this USA servers are kind of shitty. See, it's just, it's just it's glitching every two seconds. It's glitching, it's glitching. He should kill this. Hopefully he kills this, but the smart play would to be kill this. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. He's going to, he's trying to bait me into using the effect, which I'm not going to use it. Um, yeah, we're not going to use this one. No, we're not going to use the effects. Right? You're not going to get me lazy Fox. Um, you're not going to get me doing that. Hopefully we top deck an instant fusion or something like that. Even though there's only one. All right. What do you do? All right, this card is destroyed. You can target a dark spell caster in your graveyard and spell summon it. We don't have any dark spell casters in the graveyard, but we. Wait, what does this do? Okay, yeah, we can do this. Um, except Choco Magician Girl. What we can do is we can discard. Wait, what? You could target one spell caster. Yeah, we can discard you. Get a draw. Let's see what we draw here. Oh, another pendulum switch. That's pretty good. I actually like that. That's actually really good. Because now what we can do is we can get this back. Then he's going to kill it. And then he's going to special summon a different monster. Probably a, a straw man. Lazy Fox. Come on, man. Everybody's just going to surrender today. All right. So we're going to go in for the last duel of today. Sadly, we didn't get to get to do anything. And. That's, that really sucks. So, you know, all right. So, here we go. Hmm, this is some good shit going on here. So, what we can do here is that we could normal some of this, discard this, draw a card. Hmm, yeah, we can do that. Let's do that today. Um, let's go ahead and use this effect. We're going to discard you to draw a card. Oh, Magical Dimension. Now, that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and activate you and go ahead and get the pendulum switch already going off because that card right there is pretty good. What is going on today? I mean, I'm on the I'm on the EU servers again. He must be holding down S. There's a reason why this shit it keep doesn't like it always. 
when it does something like that, that's why I kind of don't like playing on Yu-Gi-Oh Pro too much is because it doesn't really help help my skills out. It really it really kind of, you know, basically makes me uh, I wouldn't say it makes me worse as a player, but it, it does not improve me as a player because like I'm not even going off of, you know, actual reactions or something. Like if, if he keeps asking what he wants to activate, the, you know, of course, it's what's the name? Like, it's, of course, it's a. Uh, Oh, I should have discarded this. It, of course, it's uh, Max Steel or Ghost Ogre or something like that. But you know, it just it just really said okay. So you must have a what's the name in your hand. That's exactly what you have. You must have a, a fucking red eyes. Yeah, that's exactly what it was. All right. So here, hmm. Fuck. Uh, let's fuck it. Let's just use the magical dimension here. Let's just use it here. Let's see if we can get away with it. Let's see if we can get away with it. Uh, he might have like a soul charge or something. He's gonna just fuck me over. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> this doesn't really it doesn't really help you out. It doesn't really improve your player. It doesn't really improve none of your skills at all. So Ooh, Dark Dorado. So we could what? This is a five, right? That's an eight. Well. Oh, I can I can reorder my what's name, right? One earth, one fire, one wind. We have that? Oh, we probably do. Do we? I think I'm going to go Dweller here. He doesn't play Tornado Dragon, does he? I don't think he does. Okay, so we're going to put... Okay, we definitely want you. Um, I guess we can get you. I guess we can get you. And... All right. So, I guess we can get you. We can just put all four kaijus at the top. Wait, whoa. Okay, Selector Order. We want this. And it doesn't really matter because I don't think we're ever going to see those. And then we're going to turn, hit him with 26. Matter of fact, we can hit him with more than 26. Because, yeah, we can hit him with uh, 26 plus 17, which is amazing. Um, Are, are you going to let me play a player or are you going to you gonna quit? Because then after that, I believe he doesn't play Tornado Dragon. You no, know, he, he doesn't. Okay, so let's go ahead and get these two attacks. I didn't know this thing was at 1800, though. That's a That's a decent amount of fucking attack. That is a decent amount of attack right there. Let's go ahead and do that. Then what we're going to do is most likely we're going to go into what's the name? Most likely we're going to uh, go into a uh, fucking dweller with these two. Um, because unless he plays Tornado Dragon, then we're going to uh, dweller. Because... This can get one of these back um, from the graveyard. Uh, Dweller also stops like Arc Brave Dragon from triggering. Let's see what he plays. Um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go Dweller. So, yeah, that's going to be the end of our turn. We can easily swing and stitch this right back. Yeah, we can easily swing and stitch that right back. Depending on what he does as a play hopefully this man does not have a scroll tra well that's that's cool wow that is that is amazing right there that is amazing and a fucking red eye spirit just sitting back there can't stop you sir cannot stop you i don't believe this targets either huh no it does target okay okay we're definitely going to swing and hitch yeah S Fucking pendulum switch. Jesus Christ. Keep saying that. Keep saying fucking sentence switch. All right. So I don't know if this is. No, this is not both players turns, is it? Yeah, sadly it isn't. Um, yeah, let's do that. Hmm. Oh, I know what I can do here. I can half his attack and then. Uh, wait, why did. Okay. Wait, did he not have one in his graveyard? Okay, well, he killed the easily revined. Used Ravine, I mean. Um, let's go ahead and use you. Okay, and then let's add, uh, not yet. We're going to add you. And this should be pumped up to what? Um, one, two, three, four. So it should gain 1,200 attack, putting it at 16. It's not going to be enough. But we're going to do it anyways. 
Okay, so wait, we're going to activate this. We're going to target this guy. Then we're going to chain this. So this should work. If I'm not mistaken, this should get around his little. Okay, well, neither of that worked. All right, so um, this card is destroyed by battle. Oh, wait, I could have just left it in there. <laughs> Yeah, I can spell summon a dark monster from my graveyard. Okay, and that, yeah, that amounts to nothing. Okay, so we just got to end our turn. All right, so I had a good idea the first time, but it just didn't turn out that good. It looks like we lose here, folks. Like I said, I have not played Magicians ever. So, I mean, I'm not the greatest with it, but I feel like we can win. We can possibly win. Oh, wait, never mind. This is not going to end up well. He's going to get the Arc Brave Dragon in the graveyard. If he's smart, he's going to send Arc Brave Dragon. And then from there, it's going to be a little, it's going to be a very big problem. Yeah, see, because this banishes all face up spells and traps, right? Yeah. Yeah, that sucks. Um, Nope, I can't even use it now. And then he gains 300 for each, 200 for each. All right, so you can kill this, and this is going to get back, um, I don't even know, probably Dark Dorado just to save some damage. Um, okay, well, that was stupid. We're going to start off with that. We're going to get uh, Charcoal Magician Girl. Okay, he's going to kill that. That's fine. That's fine with me. Let's see. He's probably going to attack this. He's not going to ever attack this Chocolate Magician Girl, I don't believe. Um, hmm. And you know, we're not going to use his effect because I want him to attack with this. Oh, you sack of shit. Well, folks, like I said, this, this game is over unless I draw like a slumber or something. All right, so that's the sticky kaiju. There's, there's literally no way to get over this. But what we can do is just go ahead and give it of that because that that is a scary card. <clears throat> but now we're just waiting on to lose. Uh, once per turn, or once per turn, this card is targeted. Yeah, you spell summon it and make it attack that. Yeah, we we just we just lose here, folks. We just lose here. There's not really too much we can do. Not too much we can do. We can kill at least one of his cards, but that's about it. All right, so that's even that's even worse because he, if he adds the fucking red eye fusion, we're just dead. I think that's what he's going to. There's no reason not to add red eye fusion. You know what I mean? Like if you play it, there's no reason not to play. It. I mean, not to add it. And no, he gets a red eye spirit, which is weird. Which is weird. We you know, we did our damage, but I mean, there's there's only so much we could actually done. This really fucked us up. So let's go ahead and use that. What do you do? You spell some other from your hand. This card is destroyed by battle. Okay, yeah, we can get this. It's pretty cool. You can add three different one of them back. Oh no, that was stupid. Well, you know what? We're gonna. Oh sure. Uh no. What 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 the fuck? Just just two? Okay, all right. So I I see what's going on here. We're getting cheated. We're clearly getting cheated here. We're clearly getting cheated here. Does it say up to three? Right with different names. I had a chocolate magician girl. Why didn't it? Okay, I I don't know what the fuck is going on here. I don't know what's going on. Uh, we don't die by battle though, right? We shouldn't. What? Oh man. I see man. <clears throat> I tried. I tried, folks. I tried. There's nothing else I can do about that. There's nothing else I can do, folks. I tried my hardest. I tried it. It didn't work. Slumber, what do you do? Okay, well <laughs> this shit is this is not gonna end well, man. This is not going to end well. Gotta add that other fucking lesson name. Oh man. We need some good shit going on here. We like I said, we can stay alive. 
we can stay alive and we can negate a trap card We can negate one trap card per turn. But uh, how long is it? We need 30 minutes, huh? Ooh, right on the 30 minute dock, too. Dot. Timeline. All right. Come on, player. Let's see what we can do, man. Let's see what we can do. Red Eye Spirit. Oh, fuck. And this is not going to work, huh? Nope. I mean, I, I knew it wasn't going to work. I don't even know why I even said that. Um, Ma'am, can't, can't, you can't do nothing else about that. I've got to do is sit here and just hope that we can fucking win. I don't know why. It, see, this is why I don't like Yu-Gi-Oh, man. Sometimes, man, I'm not, no, no, I'm not going to say this is why I don't like Yu-Gi-Oh Pro, but sometimes, man, Yu-Gi-Oh Pro just fucks up for no reason. And I don't get why it does that. It just fucks up for literally no reason. Like, this clearly says you could target up to three and add them to your hand. Why is it saying I can special summon? I don't understand. I don't even know why it even says that. Oh, no. Do you play it? Oh, wait, no, that's fine. That's completely fine. Wait, what? Oh, wait, I shouldn't have, should have did that, huh? It's cool, because this is going to trigger. And it's all right, because he can't even chain the trap card, because it'll get negated. Especially when you from the deck, right in attack mode. I don't care if you take it. <clears throat> you can't attack me, bro. You can't attack me, bro. Matter of fact, you can attack me. It's fine. That's fine. We go. We go. As I said, we're gonna get out of this. We're going to get out of this. We're gonna try our hardest. All right. He's actually going to his battle phase. That's crazy. Um. Hell yes. I want to activate Mag magician girl. Let's go ahead and get back. You. Don't need to do that. Bam. What does this do? If this card is targeted, you can special summon. No, we don't want to do that. Damage step. Damage step. Thank you. I was about to say if this shit fucking acts up again, I'm about to cry. Bam. Go ahead and kill that. But I think we die here. Because I put it in attack mode. <laughs> oh man. Well, I tried. I tried, folks. I really did try. Sadly, uh, once again, another mistake. Another mistake. I should have put this shit in defense mode. I thought it was gonna have a lot more attack than this. But sadly, we fall victim to mistakes. But I feel like we should have got three back. I don't know why we didn't. Oh, man, that sucks. All right, so here's the deck I was playing today. Um, there you go. Once again, this is sent in from a random IX. Let me just go ahead and gloss over. Okay, that was a little too fast. But this was sent in by random IX. So, yeah, shout out to him for sending in a deck. And, yeah, let me know. Let me guys know if you guys do want to see me play this again. Or if you guys like my live stream idea where, you know, I just pick a brand, I, I, I put like a little poll up and then, you know, just make a deck from scratch or, you know, something, something like that. I have no clue. Um, but yeah, so let me know what you guys think of this deck, what you guys think of the live stream. Let, let me know what you guys want me to do and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching. I had a lot of fun playing this deck. Um, so yeah, thank you guys and see you guys tomorrow.